Hey guys, welcome back to Board AF Legacy. It is year 1890 and we have a new cast of characters. And also we have a custom made built table from Uniquely Geek. That's right, brother. They made us Smosh Games a new table. Check it out. Yeah. Let's uh, meet the new characters. Hello everyone, I'm Atlas Whitmore. I'm a part of the US Navy. <laughs> I'm aboard the USS Grant, and I can't wait to get back home to the States to my hot, hot wife. <laughs> oh, boy. Hey, what's up, guys? My name's Lenny. You may have recognized me from my parents or my twin brother over here. Our parents were named Eleanor Boofy and... Edwin O'Brien. O'Brien, yeah. Believe it or not, we had families cross. <laughs> yeah, you get it? They had sex. Yeah, I play shot put, I'm 16, and I'm also a gambler. Get ready. <laughs> Hello, I'm Leopold Boodles. That's right, the Boodles. I can trace my lineage all the way back to the Boodles family line. Fae, demons, all kinds of things in there. I'm a traveling magician, medicine man, and snake oil salesman. <laughs> and I'm a bit of an occultist. I have ties to the unknown. Let's see what this journey is going to be like. Oh, the start of something new. Well, golly gee, mister, my name's Sawyer Braun, and I'm 12 years old, and I'm really good at playing jacks, kick the can, marbles, and faking my own death. I was gonna bring my friend Huckleberry Finn here, but then I decided I wanted to be monetized. <laughs> <laughs> and my calling card, since I played so many games, I can totally predict what my dice roll's gonna be. Just you wait and see, mister. Hey, I got some of those, bad boys. <laughs> Me too. get all the ladies. Eh. What's up? My name is Kravitz. I got my twin brother over there, Lenny. <laughs> I'm 16 years old. I'm a cute little boy. <laughs> and I just picked up smoking. It's pretty cool. Heard it's good for you. Right, guys? Yeah. Anyways, my calling card is I'm well-to-do. <laughs> we got a lot of money, right? Yeah. This old thing, I could easily get another. After you draw a card from the item deck, you may immediately bury it to gain two in any tray. How cool is that? All right, guys. I got the deed to the house. Check Ooh. it, the O'Brien family rocks Money, again. Eh? So I'm gonna start this game up, here we go. Ooh, okay guys, chapter eight, a Sunday. The haunt starts now. Wait, what, no, what, no, what? Turn to Whoa, entry Mr. 192 in the bleak journal. <laughs> Not to be crude, but Nani. Gee shucks, mister. Tonight, we gather on the mansion's lawn to watch the meteor shower under the full moon. Whoa. An auspicious night that happens only once every few generations. As the streaks began passing overhead, church bells peal, loud and otherworldly. We like church. Upon the 13th peal, fire shoots from the earth, engulfing the mansion's owner. But death will not take anyone today. The traitor runs inside, a charred husk aglow with an infernal light, their screams turning to horrible giggles. The evil below has finally awakened. <gasps> the second lock is broken. <gasps> there are now doors to hell. Soon he will break his chains. We are all that stand between him and his return to the world. The holder of the deed is the traitor. <gasps> brother! Whoa. Brother! I'm so sorry, brother. The Ooh. heroes and traitors should turn to Haunt 29. Hell breaks loose in their respective books. Oh, God. I've never been separated from my twin. Literally, we're always in the room, same room, all hours of the day. The fact that you're about to leave this room means something crazy is going to happen this episode. Yeah, except when we make out with girls. We're not in the same room. Don't no. Do, no. This haunt is called Hell Breaks Loose. For eight generations, mysterious items have been imbued with his evil. A brooch, a doll, even a simple veil. Each of them is connected to the others, connected to us through the helm. Each has been tainted by the infernal being chained and buried in hell far below the house. Each of these omens has caused madness, murder, blood, and insanity. But now he is awakening beneath the house. He has gained enough strength to break the barrier between heck and our world. We have one hope. 
his first omen, the chalice, can be a beacon to him. His connection to the chalice is strong. It can guide us to hell from the other worlds. It can lead us to him. From there, we may be able to strike him down while he is still chained. We know this to be true, that the traitor wants to make us his thralls to serve the evil below. So side goal, searching the other worlds. You may descend into the other worlds from any omen tile that doesn't have a search token. What you, when you do so, place a search token on that omen tile. Main goal, exploring the corners of heck. When you reveal a corner of heck while exploring the other worlds, do not bury that card. Instead, set it aside. Find the chalice, find the four corners of hell. The helm can be used any number of times this time. And that's it. As an occultist, let me try to predict this. Tarot, and we're going to, the, oh, the devil and Death. All right, that's a good. Oh. All right, guys, I read my stuff. Let's start the game. You ready, Atlas? Aye, aye, Captain. Here we go. My speed is four. Swimming through the house. <laughs> Hope you're not mad at me, brother. I'll say, I, I'm a little worried about what's about to go down. Don't worry about it. The chapel, thank God. Invoke, make a sanity roll. When? Three. That was a three. You are already at peace. Lose all moves. <laughs> Amazing. Sure. All right. Um, I don't. I hope we're okay. Dude, we're, go good. To, we're good, bro. All right, sick, bro. Uh, remember, right. my pants are always bigger because my family's a line of assholes. One. Yeah. Two. Oh, ground floor. Here we go. Ooh, laboratory. So I you see. actually keep moving because there is no uh, events drawn Amazing. this time. One, guest quarters. Search, if there is no search search token here, make a speed roll. Okay, five. Draw the top item card and place a search token on this title. Nice. Sick, bro. Guess what? I got the Ray-Ban spectacles. Hell yeah, dude. <laughs> yeah. Seeing the forbidden comes out at a cost. You may lose one sanity to re-roll a knowledge roll you just made. The second result stands. Your turn. <laughs> All right. I'm going to go ahead and use the spirits to guide me. Let's see. I'm going to walk one, two, and I feel a higher calling. Upstairs, three, and then four into an upstairs room. Oh, there it is. I bet our first omen will be here. <gasps> it is! It's the soundproof room. You could only whisper while your figure is on this tile. I can't hear you. And the omen is, well, 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 the hungry porcelain doll. On your turn, the porcelain doll counts as a ghost on your tile. And how lucky of me, because as an occultist, on my turn, I get to add one to the result of all trait rolls on tiles with at least one ghost. That was quite the lucky combination. <gasps> to be expected from the magician. <clears throat> here I go. I'm gonna go outside where I hang out all the time. And I'm gonna go this way. Dude, if you want me to teach you any uh, Same. skills. It's actually awesome. You have two 16 year old brothers right in front of you. Yeah, exactly. We know what we're doing. Yeah. You ever touched a woman's booby before? Have you ever touched a woman's booby? Yes, have you? Tell us. I'm gonna keep walking around. I'm gonna go this way. <laughs> and I'll walk across this blood field and I'll just keep on walking. Uh, talk, a spirit in the wall wants uh, an offering. Oh, golly gee. Uh, bury an item to gain two sanity. I can't do that. I'll keep on walking. Well, no, you get an item. Heather Feather, uh, a sacred item that belonged to uh, uh, you, the Boofy family. Uh, Poppy family. Poppy. Poppy family. You may bury this card to bury any just drawn event card without it taking effect. Uh, I'm actually gonna bury this to gain two sanity. Nice. That, that's actually really smart. That's right, I'm the most sane person here. Well, mm. <laughs> All here right. we go. One. All right, grab one, go please. Thank you. Ooh, cramped passageway, an inhabitant. <laughs> All right, you're gonna keep going. No, I'm not gonna keep going. No, I am going to invoke the dead of the inhabitant. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> okay. This is my dad's side of the family. They're all assholes. Sorry, dude. All right, guys, pretty crazy. You guys don't need to know anymore, but basically I invoked an inhabitant back from the dead. It's Martin the groundskeeper, pretty cool. I heard this guy is pretty cool, he's super old. I'm a pious man, oft times. You need to give in order to get. Pray with me? Come on, I said pray. Dude, he sounds like 100 years old, gross. But cool, he's back from the dead. My turn is over. Kravitz, why'd you do that? Listen, sometimes twins have to keep secrets from each other. Just think of this as a journal entry. A bleak journal, journal entry. entry. Stop! One, two, 
three. Set Armory. When discovered, draw the top item card until you get a weapon. Then bury the rest of the cards and reshuffle them in the item deck. If there are no weapons, you get nothing. So we gotta do the we gotta do a basement weapon. Pause claw hammer. Oh, this one sucks. It really does. We don't need a hammer on boat. You might need it to kill a ghost. All right. Uh, let's keep exploring this place. I'm gonna go uh, this way. All right, ground floor for you. Thank you so it's much. The porch. Front steps. The porch, where you have a nice sig. The front steps are this tile and adjacent to each other. Let's uh, let's go this way to the left. Boom, ground floor. Ah, nice. When you discover this tile, place a large obstacle token on any discovered basement tile. Then place your figure on it. Take two physical damage. Wow, you're really dumb. <laughs> hey, don't talk to my brother like that, dude. Oh. Okay, whatever, man. Blocked it. Now, everyone, I'm going to show you what a true magician does. I am on an omen tile, which means I am going to hop on down into the underworld. <laughs> it's going to be fine. So I'm going to explore four other world's tiles. Let's go. First, spectral procession. Oh, look at the look at the band of ghosts. That one's on drums. That one's on trumpet. That one's on the triangle. What's up? Next spot. I'm going to the land of fog and mist. If you end your turn here, draw the top. Well, I'm not gonna end my turn here. I'm gonna keep on going into the, oh, I'm gonna find a Warhammer. Ooh, but I'm not ending my turn here. Boom. And then I'm, one last thing, the curse of paranoia. Good. If you end your turn here, take this card. While carried after the haunt begins, if you do not use the attack action on your turn, take one mental damage. Oh, As the sanest one here, that's f***ing sick. All right. I'll keep walking this way. Good luck. All right, we've got an outside for you. Here, we, here it is. Oh, another item? That's awesome. I can drink and make a speed roll for that. Oh. Uh-oh, I found some whiskey. I'm only 12. Who cares? Hey, that's fine. Drinking from the crick, eh? I drank and when I was 10. I can predict what I'm going to roll, and I'm going to roll a three. You did! Mm. Which means what? I get to add one to it, which doesn't really matter. <laughs> You get an outside item, here we go. My mom back in the day would give me and Lenny Kravitz a scotch soaked uh, dish towel to suck on. Yeah, it was incredible. <laughs> she sure... said, you guys are in trouble, so suck on this. Oh, this this is awesome. I got a pitchfork. That seems right. All right guys, I'm gonna start to explore. Check it out, I got a speed of four, so I'm gonna explore some rooms. All right, so here's I got a ground, ground floor, floor for you. Thank you. It's scary because I don't know what you're doing yet. It's yeah. a stable. <gasps> oh! I need to invoke another inhabitant Why? from the dead. Gwelda! Oh. Come on, bitch. Oh, Gwelda. Oh. Craziest thing ever, I am 16 and I invoked another inhabitant. Her name is Gwelda and she's an old lady. She's an old cook. Happy to show you around, but first, try this pudding. Good, isn't it? Okay, bitch, I don't like pudding and I'm not a pudding kind of girl, but you are, right? Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm gonna go, but now I'm still going, cause I only moved one, so I got three more turns. <laughs> one. Ground four. Library, okay, study. Make a knowledge roll, sick. Okay. Five. Thank you so much. <laughs> Number three, you learn nothing, lose all moves. What? Nice. Okay, well I lose all my moves, that's fine, cause I get to roll the inhabitants move. Oh, dreadful. Are they like zombies or are they like demons now? They have feelings, okay? They're just awoken from the dead. They're a cook and a groundskeeper. So like, they look so no, we're not like scared. ghosts? Talking like they're, ghosts like every, like, they're like every scary movie ever. Are they like, do they still have people yeah, meat? Or are they time, all skeletons? Kind of they're gonna scare you, they're my friends. Brother, look me in the eyes. Should I be scared of these people? No, brother, you're fine. We're everyone fine. else should be scared. No, 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 everyone else should be scared. You're okay. good. Listen, I know we just met, kid, but I think you're straight Martin, the groundskeeper, gets to move speed of four. Damn. Three. All right. Keep him right there. Cool, son of a bitch is hanging out in the staircase. Gotta move the cook, too. One, thanks, brother. Yeah, brother. All right, lastly, I'm gonna consult the helm. Shit. Cause I can. Jesus. Okay, this is what I got. Which one is that? The V. The V for vagina. All right, I'm gonna roll one die on the V. One. <gasps> Your own brother gets judged. What happens to your brother? Oh, I really didn't want to do this to you, bro. So, you've been judged, which means you take two general damage. I'm just gonna say this right now. This whole time, I've been blurring the lines between friends, 
my brother's here, and you, my blood brother. And now the line is being crossed. Sawyer, this magician man, and this sailor, definitely not gay <laughs> male, is... They're my new brothers now. What are you talking about? Yeah, we're his brothers. Also, we're all gay. It's 1890. It means oh. happy. Ahoy, ahoy! It's my turn, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna help out my brother. Mm. No. Ew. <laughs> oh no. Crawl space. Ooh, get real small. Fog. Minus one die. Block line of sight. Oh, you're fine. You just okay. be, if you had to roll there, you'd be f But you're fine. So now and you I'm, get to keep on moving. I'm going to keep on moving. All right, for another basement spaceman. Get far the f away from my blood. Stop that. Furnace room. Take one die of physical damage if you end your turn here. But I'm not ending here. Wait. One, two, three. Woo! Four. There we go. I'll find another, but there's another basement. Oh, my God. The operating theater. Operate. Choose a different person on this tile. Make a knowledge roll. Oh, if you come into here, I can operate on you. <clears throat> Don't. Do don't I do know. Yeah, I can heal you right now if you come into here. I've got saws, I've got uh, scalpels, I've got little hammers. <laughs> All right, I'm headed out. One. And you're gonna make me look for another basement tile, huh? Two. Yeah. <laughs> Chasm. You may explore the other worlds from this tile. Ooh. All right. At this point, life has been crazy. Let's fucking go. Careful, All right, brother. so you're gonna hop in? Yeah. So that would l land you on the land of mist and fog. Actually, that's not bad. Well, yeah, it is. I will not be going to the other world. I'll sit here in the chasm and I'll think about all the disloyalty that's been happening in the last 10 minutes. Hey. <laughs> Ow! All right, I, Leopold Boodles, just having come back from the other world with a curse of paranoia, and it's your fault, isn't it? Will now be walking downstairs. One, two. Now I'm well aware that if I don't attack something on my turn, that I'm going to take some damage. So I see this old man that looks can you describe, is he a ghost? Is it just a skeleton? What are we dealing with here? Is it people meat? All right, guys, pretty crazy. He's a ghost. That's because that's what he looks like to you. To me, he just looks like a wonderful groundskeeper. Great, I'm gonna beat the shit out of him. Um, all right, Do your so worst. I'm going to roll my three might and then add one to whatever the result is due to my hungry porcelain doll ghost tile. There we go, it's a four total against what? One, two, three, four. So mm, the balance. Fight me. All right, so one, two, and I'm gonna keep on moving. He's an obstacle for me, right? So three, now I'm out in the hallway. Whew, almost beat up that ghost. However, I did use the attack, so I don't take any mental damage. Everything is fine. I'm still the sanest one here. Way I see it, we have the equal amount of saneness, so we're both the sanest one here. Golly gee, kid, I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> All right. <laughs> and I'm still outside, which means I'm gonna keep walking around. Yep. <laughs> I've been doing this for hours. Oh, that's actually, it's a crypt, and there's an omen card. Oh, nice. So let's get you that omen, champion. Apothecary kit of mercy. Oh, good. Uh, I can drink and, and you grab a vial from inside the kit, roll dice equal to the number of ghosts on your tile. You found my medicine bag. <laughs> I'm gonna get going here. My speed is four. Ooh, common room, secret passage. There's also a rune in here, that's pretty cool. Okay, wow. I get one more. Great, here you go, oh, fuck my bones. Winter bedroom and guess what? I get to invoke another inhabitant. Mm. Are they yeah. all on the main floor? Yeah. I guess. I invoked another inhabitant. It's the cat. Two pence. Tuppence. It's the cat. Tuppence. Oh, sh brother. I never told you this, but in our family, we're really allergic to cats. Oh, no. Uh. Oh, God. I put it right on the card. Well, I guess I'm keeping it. Well, I'm done with my rolls on that. <laughs> but I get to roll all my inhabitants. That's pretty cool, that's pretty cool that they're all directly next to me. I like, like that. Martin, the groundskeeper, is gonna go one. And then I'm gonna move Gueldo, the cook. One. All right, and then I'm gonna move Tuppence. Speed of five. Christ. I have a feeling it's awesome if they all end up on my tile. Yeah, so I wanna do you, something. Magician. Brother is about to keep my brother safe, and attack Mr. Boodles here, who can see the future. Did you see this coming? I sure did, you piece of shit. 
All right, Martin the Ground. Actually, it's not really me. It's Martin the Groundskeeper. The ghost. Ah, uh, yes, the ghost. So, I defended against him once. I'll do it again. I get to roll any one of his traits, and I'm going to roll the highest. Knowledge, six. So my six versus your defense of might. Okay, I need another dice. All right, take it. Okay. All right, oh, wow, this is Martin. Wow, my hands just touched. That was weird. You didn't, like, touch my hands? No, you just sneezed because the cat is all gross. Yeah. I invented germs. Whoa, dude. Did you just do that? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> One, God, two, three, so four, many. five, six, seven. That's amazing because I have to max out my roll. So it's seven versus seven versus. Um, all right. So here's the deal. I am going to uh, do the helm. We like church. We like church. We like church. We, we like, like church. We we like like the off. You are too twelve. Dude, I can teach you a lot of things. Like what? Okay, a woman likes to have their feet rubbed. Sawyer, Whoa. don't look at him in that's the eyes. That's true, that's true. Women love it when you, uh, you, uh, you firm hand on a shoulder and a firm hand on the other shoulder. They love shoulders. Don't listen, don't listen. They love don't shoulders. Do they do? Right. Yeah, no they, women happen. love having their shoulders. I'm going to re-roll with my knowledge here. Here I go. One, two, three. <gasps> one, two, three, four, five, six. So it's six versus your seven. I only lose one damage. Does your other world curse give you anything? Sure doesn't. Now, is that are you gonna invoke anyone else? Is that is that all you do? Yeah, is I you still move? got Tuppence. Oh, no. Nope. You got Gwelda. Nope. And... I'm gonna consult the helm, motherfuckers. Ah, oh, gross. Oh, right? look it! I got the O for the O base. You know what that means? Is it is it the O with the dot? It could only possibly be the Whitmore family. It's the Whitmore family. Cool. Damn, dog. Them's the breaks. So you have to take away two from any general. Just automatically. Ahoy, ahoy! Let's get it started. <laughs> what? Find another basement tile for you. Just dark altar. When you leave this tile, you may place your figure on any upper or ground floor tile that has at least two ghosts on it. Whoa, oh, an upper wild. decker. So it's like a trans, it's like a teleporter. <laughs> One, I think two. we're at maybe out of basement, oh, okay. but we can see. I'll do my best for you. There's one. Yes, it's yours. Oh, a servant's quarters, and there's an omen. Did I? How interesting. So I can go into, the, what, what do I, do I take this? You do. Okay, the brooch. Nice. Race. A brooch. That's right. <laughs> At the start of your turn, gain additional moves equal Skeletal to the number brooch. of ghosts on your tile. <laughs> okay, I am with the chasm and I am going to get otherworldly. All right, so we're gonna start out with a spectral procession as an event. When you discover this card, you may bury a sacred item to gain one knowledge, otherwise oh. take two mental damage. I don't have any sacred items, all I have is my heart. So you're gonna take two mental damage? Uh, yeah. All right. My mental damage I'm gonna take is one sanity. Whew, this is rough and one knowledge. Brother. Leaving me truly in the red, brother. Well, here's the good news. We've got Worm, a serpent, perhaps winged, worm. emerged from the radiant mists. When you discover this card, you may bury a non-omen weapon you carry to gain one might, otherwise take two physical damage. Why did you go there? This is what you did. I didn't do that, brother. And the fact that our families ever intertwined, let me just be clear, they will never mix again. The poppies will never be friends with the O'Briens. I draw a line now. Stop that. Awkward. All right, so uh, let me just look real quick at all these people we got in front of me. Oh, Tuppence, you can use anything to attack me. Um, all right, one. And so, Gwelda, um, I'm going to fight this old lady using might, which I have to do. Gwelda. Um, that's going to be a five. <gasps> it's a three! I am going to consult the helm, and if I am judged, or any hero is judged, we get to choose one thing happening. And one of those things could be that monsters that are stunned this turn are actually killed. Ooh. We so like church. That's pretty awesome. We awkward. like this church. Lady. Oh, it could only be you, Boodles. So I'm I'm hoping, not Boodles, a bronze. So I'm hoping I roll a two. God damn it. All right, well, that's fine. Everything's fine. That was fun. Cool. Fun journey. All right, I'm gonna start traveling into the other world. <laughs> a one and a two and a three. Land of tunnels and mines. Nah, I'm gonna keep on going. I've worked in mines before because I'm 12. Oh. <laughs> it's God. 1890. Oh, that's probably, <laughs> probably true. That explains a lot. Curse of in impediment. 
Oh. If you end your turn here, take this card. While carried, discovering a new tile costs one extra move. To get rid of it, if you end your turn in the outside region, become the traitor or die. Bury this card, this card is not an item. Nothing happened. I went to the other world and I was just fine. That's the second time I faked my death. <laughs> okay, buddy. Okay, guys, I'm gonna move my groundskeepers first. So, my little cook is stunned Gwelda. Poor lady, she was just trying to cook you guys some stew. Mm. So Martin can move four. So I'm gonna go, you know what? I'm gonna go to the basement, y'all. One, two, three, four. Okay, Tuppence is gonna get feisty. I hate cats. One, two. I'm gonna attack Sir Boodles over here. Okay, the that's- The seer. Mm, I'm not a seer, I'm an occultist. Ooh. I'm the seer. That's true. Because that I see all sorts sense. of stuff, like trees and rivers. Mm. All right, Tom. Young man, I want you to predict how this is going to go for me. Hmm. Dark magician. Not good. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna attack you with my highest, which is my knowledge, eight. Wait, Toppins has a knowledge of eight? That's right. What, the actual f that's yeah, right. Fucking cat. All right. That's right. Well, roll eight dice then, I guess. Cats are insane. Are we still going to Cambridge together next year? Not any fucking more. Whoa. I was yeah. up. Jesus. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. This I will defend. This was my friend, brother. What's what is my first name? Boodles. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> brother. All right, I am going to roll three to defend, and I get to add one to that, so that's a five. So five, I only take six knowledge damage, oh. so let me see here, hold on, hold on, let's figure this out. Wow, are you still the sanest one here? Yes, actually, <laughs> because I'm just dumb, but I know what's going on. Wait a second, you're totally dead. Dude. Oh, I'm dead. Okay. Oh, I'm quite dead. Then give me your sticker, because you are officially marked. What do you give mean? Me your, give me your house sticker and I'm gonna put it on my tablet over here and you are officially marked. Dog, what? <laughs> Maybe I played too much shot put last night and my brain's having issues. No. What does it mean to be marked? It means you're marked by the devil. Oh. And I own your soul. Oh my God. I already own your soul anyways, brother. Boodles is now, I he is marked and I own his soul. When Boodles is marked, this is what happens. You do not die. You do not place a ghost. Set all their traits to critical. Then adjust for any items or omens they are carrying. Well, young man, I always knew you'd be my prodigy. And I've got some news for you. I've got to drop my sanity to critical. And I know that's very disappointing to you, but that makes you the sanest one here. Did you say critical and not dead? Critical. Great, so my sanity is four. I'm almost the sanest one here. <laughs> okay, I got three more, three more cat roll moves. This cat's insane. Yeah. This cat is too much. Three, all right, I'm in the blood field. How cool is that? Let me move me, so I got a speed of four. <laughs> I'm gonna explore right up here. New ground. spots, huh? Ground floor, mm -hmm. baby. More ground floor time. Let's check it out. There we go. This is a very nice hat that you made yourself. You found every omen tile. Okay, I'm going to the kitchen. Eat, make a mite roll. Do I want to? I don't think I want to, I'm not that hungry. I'm strong. Okay, haha, <laughs> I'm crazy, you guys. That was a trick. <clears throat> uh, two. <sighs> Small obstacle, God damn it! I can only move one more. What's up, buddy? So I'm gonna consult the helm just for fun. Yeah, yeah. Okay. D, as in Duke. Dick. Hey, oh, you're sick. Do that. Don't do that. Yeah, I guess I'm a new ah. brother. <laughs> <laughs> uh oh, it's Boodles and my brother is on here. Uh oh, I gotta roll this dice. God, I hope I don't get you. Well, actually, I already killed Boodle, so I need someone. Yeah, kill me. Do it twice. One. Fooey, it's you. Okay, guys, so I got Poppy, my brother, but you know what? I know you don't believe it, brother, but I love you and I don't want you to die. So I'm gonna roll again and put my sticker there. Dude, stop laughing, you're crazy. That was just How like, crazy is he? She's so crazy. Don't, <laughs> don't talk Dick Sawyer. You're what? so crazy, slap me five. Uh, oh! Ah! Okay, I'm gonna roll again, because I can. I'm gonna roll again for the D. All right. Net, one. One. Oh, well, you got Poppy. <laughs> Look what you did. Dang, dude. So this sucks, and I have to take damage from my brother, which I really don't want to. Why is this my curse? 
I'm sorry, Lenny. It really sucks for you. I'm sorry, Lenny. How you got much? It two. And what? Anything? Anything. Anything. Dude, be smart. This devil that's inside of me, it's taking over. I, I didn't make that decision to hurt you. No, for sure. But the Poppy family will never talk to the O'Brien family for the rest of their lives. Why are you doing that? Stop! Ahoy, ahoy. I guess I'm going into hell now. I can do that from here? No, you can do it from the castle. Yeah, I can do it. Oh, yeah, no, you got it. Yes, the omen. Yes. Okay, great. Or... All right, so we'll start with one, the land of roots and burrows. You want to enter card here? No. All right, but number two, we've got uh, inscribed amulet. Do you want to end your turn here? No. Okay, we got number three, avarice. Well, do you want to end your turn there? No. Okay, <laughs> then we're gonna put down this metamorphosis. When you discover this card, you may bury a sacred item uh, to gain one sanity, otherwise lose one sanity. I'll gain a sanity. Okay. Buried. All right. All right, back to hell. Here I go, I have a speed of two. All right. We've got one, ooh, a quarter of hell. When you discover this card, take one mental damage. Oh no. Then bury this card and draw another without using a move. Brother. But we have discovered it, but you have to take a mental damage. Brother. I did this for you, little guy. Oh, wow. And you, little guy. <laughs> <laughs> All right. What about me, dude? <laughs> You're fucking. I'm in possessed by a hell devil creature. Okay, way to play the victim card. But I am a victim <laughs> card. Goodbye. May my family never speak to the O'Briens ever again. Ah, uh, yeah, we'll see about that. You will. <laughs> no. Wait, you're not actually dead. You're just marked. On here, brother. But you're not dead. I'm resurrecting you back to critical. So put all of your traits back to critical. And also, if you have any omens, if you have any items, you can use them towards. Do you got anything? All I have is a pair of fucking Ray Bans. <laughs> can, can you use those to anything? No. Hmm. All right. I got two. Two more to go. Oh, that's your me. goal. Good to know. Cool. No, it's not. No, yep. Now I may be on the precipice of death but you can't spell precipice without piss. Hell yeah. So it's time for me to attack you, O'Brien, because I'm pissed at you, and I've still got three might, baby. Do your worst, dude. I will do my best to do my worst. One, two, three, I'm going to re-roll using the helm. We like church, we like oh, church. We like church, can I We like church, we like church. All right, so let's see here. I'm going to roll three, and that's a two. So, wait, was that that? Yeah. Oh, so I'm getting a total of five coming at you with might. You are lacking the strength of your ancestors. Okay. I that take no damage. Hurts. That actually really hurts my feelings. Then I am going to use the rest of my turn to go over over here. I'm gonna go back down to the other world. Cause that's awesome. You've already searched on the Roman oh, tile, so you gotta find a different. Shit. That you're a mile and a half outside coming. away from everyone else. And this is the, a dead end. You better right. stab that cat with a f One, two, three, spear. four. You don't want to. All right, I'll kill the cat. Careful, what? that cat is the a cat's fucking cunt. Oh, sorry. I'm an, I have a pitchfork. <laughs> I have a pitchfork, pitchfork, so I roll a two additional dice, and I can also guess that I'm gonna roll like a seven. Oh, shit. <laughs> you're, you're, gonna want, you're gonna wanna helm that I'm one. I'm gonna my helm guy. that one. We like church. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna roll six. a Go, six. Yeah, five or six. Oh my God. Christ. Four. Against uh, Well, that's the Braun family for you. Against <laughs> And also I'm 12. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> 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 All right. I'm gonna die. You done? Here we go. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna move Gualdo. One, two, whatever, baby. I'm gonna move Martin. Where are you, baby? Speed of four. One, two, Three. Yeah, 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 yeah. What do you want, Martin? I'm gonna attack you, you oh, yeah? sail boy. Oh yeah? I train with the Navy, so good luck, brother. Yeah, well I train with hell because I'm possessed right now. Hell hath no fury like the ocean. Sure, okay, buddy. Okay. Here we go. I'm gonna attack you with my biggest, which is knowledge, and that's six. I don't like that. You have to defend with knowledge. What is it at? Three. Mm, good luck with that. Yeah! Seven. Six. One, two, three. Uh, do you want to helm it? <laughs> Try it again. At least we have one corner of hell. One. Okay, you gotta so, take six knowledge. Knowledge specific? Yeah. Okay, I'm dead. Yeah! 
Give me a sticker, buddy. <laughs> Don't worry, guys. I'm still out there. <laughs> I'm crushing Thank this. Thank goodness the Braun so, family. Yeah. Let me remind you, you're not dead. Left the okay? house. Okay? I just resurrected you. So bring all your traits to critical, and you can use any of your omens or your items to help you out. Do you have any fun things? A claw hammer. All right. I got three puppies. <laughs> I still got Tuppence and myself, motherfuckers. I'm not gonna move Tuppence the cat yet. I'm gonna move myself, because there's someone I need to talk to. One, two, three. You're coming to talk to me. No. Four. <gasps> I'm coming to talk to you, brother. What else do you have to say? I have to say that I have actually hated you for a really long time. You are better. <laughs> I have hated oh, you for a really long alive time. I'm listening to you right now. Do you you're know gonna why? Say this. Do you know why? Why? Because dad and mom loved you more than me, and you were better at shot put than me, and you always lied in my face. You said I was good, and I wasn't. Mom hated your gut. I know, I just said that. And I got all the breast milk. I know. That's why my muscles are huge. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I barely got any breast milk. When I got to all of those breasts, they were empty. And this is how you repay me? Empty. I sucked on nothing, so I'm gonna fight your ass because I want my own breast milk of glory. You ready? Gentlemen, before you battle, I wish for you to draw upon the cards one last time. Yeah, you give it to me, boots. Tell me when to stop. Stop. All right. Here you go, and there. Card. Well, well, well. Justice? Justice. No, that's not fair. Justice. That is not fair. Drop! All right, there you go. Yay, the <laughs> devil! See? What did I tell you guys? I fucking possess! Count us in. Three, two, one. one, two, three, yeah. four, five, six, seven. I don't think seven. you want that. Oh, you do not want that. <laughs> you do not want that. I said kiss, you freak. <laughs> oh. 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 oh, no. Oh, no. Sorry. Put your hat back on. Your hair is so straight. Why? <laughs> Who's Why? straightening your hair? Only... <laughs> <laughs> Who said that Why? straightening your hair was okay? You've been mad under that this whole time? <laughs> yeah, what? Who said that straightening your hair was okay? Ladies love it. It's when actually very K-pop. I kind of like it. Three, two, two one. one. These are wet. Two, three. Three versus two. <gasps> wow. He punches his brother. Suck on that titty. <laughs> I didn't. I didn't. Yeah. Don't. Didn't. Oh. <laughs> ah. Wait, wait a second. So wait a second. Why don't you just roll against so Wait a second. I think that was just for pride. You are lacked. You are lacking the strength of your ancestors. I take no damage. What the? That was just for fun. All right, Tuppence <laughs> gets to move five speed, but guess what? You know what? I'm just gonna stay right here oh, with no. the brawny little Sawyer boy, 12 year old boy who I thought we were friends. Let's do this. I'm gonna fight you, so I'm gonna fight with my highest knowledge, eight. What's your knowledge? Five. Cats have like a million lives. Wow, that's a three if I've ever seen Whoa, one. Whoa, I have a chance! Wait, wait, wait. Do the re -roll with the helm. Yeah, I'm doing no. the re-roll with the helm. Can I have my sticker? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> it's okay! <laughs> <laughs> I get to re-roll this baby! This that's cat. <gasps> it's a five. Six. Six. It's a six. All right, I can do this. Good luck. You can do this. Come on, Sawyer. Watch this. Here we go. I got this. I'm gonna f this cat up. There we go. Uh, That's a three. That cat is alive and well. Oh, no. oh shit. Don't he tell went, me a cat killed his 12 year old. The cat killed the 12 year old. It happens in every boy's story. But he's not story. dead, he's, he's just not, He's not dead, he's just, wait, no, he's just crit. You just critted him. You got him three down to knowledge. Yep. It's your turn. Yeah, I guess I'm just gonna move. You guys one, are not two, good. One, two, three, four. Wow, you have four speed still, That's insane. Yeah. All right, well, there's nothing you can do, so go on. Yeah, I got speed of two. Go um, to the other world. Beat him up. Chasms, chasms. I've already d gone through the chasms. You can, chasms okay. you can do infinitely. Yes, let's do it. All right, one. Sphere of Amber, if you end your turn here, but you're not going to, right? No, I want to keep going. I got one more. All right, and we found a corner of hell. When you discover this card, take one mental damage, then bury this card, so you take another mental t damage. All right, that takes me out. It takes you out. We both did, but we're still not dead. We can't That's right. die. You can't die. You can't die, but we found two corners of heck. Okay. It's my turn. 
time for me to really shine by going to explore through this o omen town. And yet there's a small obstacle, so I don't get to do it. Your turn. I'm gonna f this cat up. Hey. I'm so glad you said that. Get out of here. <laughs> you get out of here right now. All right, I've got, I've got, uh, I can use five because I have the pitchfork. What do you, what do you want? What do you want, Mike? Might. Yeah, and I'm gonna roll a five. Two, three, four, five, six. All right, I rolled a six. Nice. Six, six, six. I'm rolling for tuppence and the might is two. Oh, <sighs> sucks. no. Sucks. I wonder what'll I... happen. Three, basically six. Nice. Uh. So actually, Wait, if you consult is, the helm is, this time. Is Tuppen's dead? Or no, she's just done. But if you consult the helm this time and it lands on one of us as a hero. I'm gonna invoke the helm. All right, so pull out one of the runes and we'll make a roll. We get to nice. choose whether or not that cat is dead. Oh, cat, sweet, it's cat. the one that has has me on it. Nice. The chicken foot. It has you and the Whitmores. Now right. make a draw, make a roll. If you get a zero, I swear to Christ. Way to, way to really brawn it up there, champ. Dang it's it. crazy how consistent your family is. All right, as a 16 year old, I got a lot of tough decisions, like where to go to college, who's gonna be my next girlfriend, how is my brother gonna live with me, and asking the devil for some help. Okay, so I'm gonna ask the devil, dude, what do I do? Uh, you should let them all live. Uh, just like, just saying, uh, you should let them all live. Oh, that's, that's weird. That doesn't sound like the devil. He actually sounds like a hot woman in my head. Okay, I'm gonna consult the hound. Thanks, buddy. All right, here we go. Woo! Consult the hound. Are you the Eye of Sauron. Okay. Oh, dude, it has both of me on there. This is sick. I bet you'll never roll a zero. Yeah, you can't roll a zero. If you, roll, if you roll a zero, you're a virgin. You silly little. I'm six. not a virgin, you guys. Well, I've had sex a lot of times. That's right. problematic. I've zero. had sex a lot of times. Nice. Oh, it's One. you. Oh, oops, me. So you know what that means. I don't. I don't. We really no. don't. I get to bring all my inhabitants to whatever tile I want. I'm gonna bring Gwelda and Martin all the way over to the bronze. Baby. You're really all gonna gang up on a 12 year old? That's Fine, right. I'll beat you all up. Okay, good luck, buddy. Oh, I've got my slingshot. Okay, I'm gonna attack you. Martin's gonna attack you first with the highest knowledge, six. Okay, well, I've got three knowledge, so deal with it. Okay, I'm gonna roll, I will. I'm gonna roll a two. Nice. Oh, nice. Three. three. Hell yeah. Okay, that's that really not gonna helps a really lot. get you far. <laughs> this is Martin, the groundskeeper. Okay, so no, that's a lot. Well, start. that's a lot. That's so many. That's eight. eight. So, um, so Take if five from your knowledge, or what was it? Is, it, from, is it just knowledge? No, it's five from knowledge. Okay, so if I just if I just do the blip. <laughs> oh baby, <laughs> give me your sticker. You are not dead. You are marked by the devil. El diablo. I've had everybody's family on my card here, mm. and that means y'all all marked, and that means I have all your souls, and that means. I win this fucking game. What? What? Can you read what happens? What even happens? Woo! -wee! If you win, turn to entry 140 in the Bleak Journal. God, I love this journal. Age 12 plus. Good for you. Oh, nice. <laughs> 140. It is done. Perfect vessels for your master. That's me. You glide through the worlds, leading the heroes and inhabitants of the house behind you down toward hell, where he lies chained with iron upon a cold stone altar. He is beyond death, an infernal being kept alive by means unknown. The skin has been cut from his chest, leaving a ragged hole. Ew. You approach with caution. You okay, buddy? Only to see the eyes awaken and a smile run across his sharpened teeth. Yep. You have brought me a gift. No. This pleases me. You will do well. His limbs flex against the chains. Yeah. Straining, straining, and then the chains break. Iron crashing to the bleak ground. Even you back up. Whoa, whoa. Away from him toward the light, the sun, anywhere. What have you done? I am free. He slowly rises. These thralls will serve me well. He smiles at those you have brought him. That's you guys. 
It is a, a chilling sight. It is as I have always said. Nothing of any known world can harm me. My strength has returned. We will leave and return to my world. The youngest hero, oh, the most innocent, the hardest to corrupt, regains a moment of clarity. That's you, dude. What? If the chalice is the entry to hell, destroying it will close the portal, like breaking a key off in a lock. Their young hands reach out and grab the chalice. That's you, dude. He may be unbound, but he can be trapped in this world if the door is shut. Ow! With a sudden strength, their young foot crushes the chalice, closing the door to hell. Your master is angry. I'm so angry right now. He is trapped here, and you with him. What did I do, dude? Uh. The house shudders, and portions of it collapse in on itself. Screams can be heard within. None of those who had entered were ever found, though no one wished to search terribly thoroughly. The house was abandoned. People who passed by made the sign to ward away evil. Don't get in there. Years passed. The house fell into disrepair until the state decided to use the vacant property as a hospital for those with illness of the mind. Oh. Destroy the deed to the house. <gasps> no one owns the house anymore. And destroy the chalice omen card. It is lost. He is awake. Sawyer, destroy the chalice card. Okay. Great. And I will destroy the deed card. Oh, you could have lit it on fire with the cigarette. That would have been way cooler. All right. Whoa. Whoa. Communism, no one owns it. Check it out. I got curls, you got curls. Still brothers? No.